hello everybody welcome back to my channel now i want to share how to prepare si for sic udc mains within just 3 days and how to be your strategy in last 3 days now i share this and so guys please watch this video till end i think this video will be useful to you if you follow this and i also follow this kind of schedule that's why i make this video and i think this will be also useful to you okay so let's start so today is you know 26th of april and i recorded this video today and uh, yeah so last three days means uh, our sic udc mains exam is scheduled on uh, 30th april and uh, that's why last three days is very vital for us and uh, try to prepare as much as i can so you see here i prefer to just give one mock tomorrow and it's obviously a sectional mock test because i don't want to give any stress in my mind to give a full mock test and i already completed my full mock test series of textbook and i gave uh, two mock test of yes i see this immense full mock test actually in utter uh, 247 platform and according to me pm mock is so high level mock test so that's why i don't give this mock and uh, just practice ga questions from this mock test series and if you say about you know smart kidda i give two or three mocks from there and uh, try to revise all ga questions mentioned there so that's uh, why i completed this all uh, platforms mock test series and uh, try to revise all ga questions also i don't know what kind of question can be asked in you know main examination uh, in real examination so yeah ga is a very unpredictable subject so how much you prepare that depends upon you and uh, really it's too boring so but just for examination you have to prepare yourself and myself also very well otherwise we don't perform well in the real examination and uh, we cannot lined up in the race okay so that's why i have to prepare current affairs and static gk i mean this pending current affairs what i didn't read in this 14 to 15 days after prelims examination right so i want to revise them all tomorrow and uh, also i want to do some you know ga question quiz that was available in affairs cloud and pm mock if you want to practice them just go there and uh, give the quizzes and i think this will help you to remember all the ga questions and uh, you can perform well in the real examination and uh, i also prefer this and if i talk about the march months and april months current affairs we all know that the exam is scheduled on april april last day right so i experienced that most of the mains examination give uh, last recent two months current affairs of the data dated examination that's why i prefer to read most importantly last two months means march months and april months up to 15th of april very well and uh, that's why i'm telling this if you follow this i think it will be helpful and you can uh, may see some questions come on in your examination and i see that in ibps po mains examination also uh, i see some kind of question asked from last december months right so that's why i'm telling this i think uh, may they come may they ask some questions from march and april months most important questions basically so that's why you can prepare current affairs in this last two to three days and uh, yeah whose examination is scheduled of uh, 7th of may for sic mts means sic mts prelims examination they have to give one mock otherwise they would uh, you know lost their speed and uh, really speed is very important factor in qualifying any kind of examination of banking or sic because if we cannot perform well i mean uh, cannot manage speed in any prelims examination we see that uh, in real examination we cannot 
complete the whole paper in proper time and uh, just because of lack of time we didn't attempt or don't attempt some kind of questions which may come on to me or you also right so have to manage time properly and uh, that's why i prefer to give one prelim sectional mock test sectional mock test i'm saying because uh, if we invest our time to give any uh, full mock test of prelims that's why that's why you, i see that uh, most of the time goes out and uh, cannot time invested in mains preparation so just to try to give this three days in mains focused on this uh, three days for mains examination so that will be good for me and that's why I'll, i also tell this for you and uh, last 29th of april i mean uh, exam before day it's really i don't want to read any kind of thing and i re need some rest and i want to take myself full chill and uh, relaxed because if we do not give our mind proper rest we cannot perform better in the real examination may forget some important tips may forget some important topics which may lead to a very good marks in proper examination i mean real examination but just for restlessness i cannot or we cannot perform well so just because of this i prefer to text rest take rest before exam okay just before exam date and uh, yeah if you do not meditate i prefer to meditate so and i regularly follow this if i cannot meditate that's why i prefer to listen some swathi musics and uh, which may calm our mind and uh, that may give us positive vibes i also prefer this to listen to some good musics and really music gives us so much positive vibes so you may follow this and uh, last but the not least try to revise all static gk tomorrow and uh, don't try to read any new topics if you want to read some new topics like uh, static gk part from history parts if you want to read some static gk history geography from new topic then you see which you have already read you cannot remember and you may forget all those things that will lead you destruction right so i think if you follow this kind of points it will help you and i follow this that's why i make this video i hope guys it will help you a lot and uh, try to give a uh, mock test score in my channel and uh, i will also upload this future also and uh, please guys even new in my channel please subscribe my channel and uh, click the bell icon to get all the notifications when i upload any kind of videos and this channel is really helpful to you you may like the video if you like this and uh, that's all for today best of luck for the examination and thank you so much for watching this video thank you all